What's up everyone? I'm Pamela. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Sister Pam Spook Fest 2024. Today I'm going to be ranking the Halloween movie posters. I've done quite a few different rankings on the channel for the Halloween franchise, but I've never ranked the posters. And one of you guys actually requested this. I apologize, I can't remember who, but thank you so much for the request if you were the one who requested this. There are 13 Halloween movies in the franchise and let's get into it. A certain rule push the laws and you end up dead. This is the moment when the supposedly dead killer comes back to life. Not in my movie. Surprise, Sydney. He's gone mad. We all go a little mad sometimes. A very simple formula. You want to play psycho killer? Everybody's a suspect. No, please don't kill me, Mr. Ghostface. I want to be in the sequel. I'll be right back. Okay, I think it's going to go something like this. Before we do get started, I do just want to remind you guys that I have some merch for sale. Sister Pam Spookfest 2024 t-shirts and sweatshirts. You can find the link down below in the description if you would like to purchase one. And I also have my typical merch for sale, Team Mocker, Team Loomis, and Stew Crew. But let's get started. So coming in at number 13 in last place, I have Halloween 2 by Rob Zombie. This poster is just kind of boring and plain in my opinion. There's really not that much going on. I will say I like the font, but you know, other than that, it's it's nothing special and it's just my least favorite. Coming in at number 12, I have Halloween Ends. Kind of the same thing as the previous one for me. It's just kind of boring and plain. Definitely the worst one out of the newer trilogy. You know, the lighting is pretty dark, which I guess maybe is symbolic kind of, but I don't know. It's just not one of my favorites. Next up in 11th place, I have Halloween Kills. This one is definitely better than Halloween Ends. The lighting is better. I like the colors a lot more. And Michael's burnt mask is pretty cool looking. Next up in 10th place, I have Rob Zombie's Halloween from 2007. This one's actually kind of cool. I like that Michael's face is in the back and contains images from scenes from the movie. And the font on this one is pretty cool too. Next up in ninth place, I have Halloween Resurrection. I like that the characters are shown in the reflection of the knife. That's pretty cool, but I kind of wish Michael was featured more on the poster. I mean, I guess he kind of does take up a lot of space on the poster, but you know, you don't see his full face. I'm also not too crazy about the font. I feel like it could be a little bolder. Coming in at number eight, I have Halloween H2O. Kind of the same thing for this one. I wish Michael was featured more on the poster. He's kind of just hidden off to the side. Also with this one, I feel like in the late 90s, so many movies were trying to kind of copy Scream's style of poster with like all the characters' heads just displayed next to each other. So many movies did this in the late 90s. Obviously, H2O was kind of inspired by Scream. I mean, Kevin Williamson worked on this one. They even have a scene from Scream 2 playing in the movie. And I just feel like with the poster even, you can tell that it was kind of inspired by Scream, which is pretty cool, I guess. You know, you guys know that I am a huge fan of Scream, but I don't know, this just isn't one of my favorite posters, but definitely somewhere kind of in the middle. Next up in seventh place, I have Halloween 4. Now, Halloween 4 is one of my favorite movies from the franchise, but as far as the poster, it's not one of my favorites, but it is definitely one of the better ones. I like that Michael takes up most of the poster. He is pretty much the star of the poster as he should be. I mean, this is his franchise. And I do really like the font on this one. I like the font for Halloween and for the number four. Coming in at number six, I have Halloween 2018. I actually like this one. It's kind of menacing looking. Michael's face just coming out of the complete darkness like that. And I do think the mask looks really cool too. 
And this one is just definitely my favorite one out of the newer trilogy. Coming in at number five, I have Halloween 5. Again, I like that Michael pretty much dominates the poster. I like the knife on the poster. And I like that they have Jamie Lloyd in her clown costume. Jamie Lloyd is one of my favorite characters in the franchise. Coming in at number four, I have Halloween 6. I really don't care for the movie at all. Halloween 6 is one of my least favorite of the franchise, but I actually really like the poster. The blue coloring of it is really cool. Michael looks menacing. I like the knife. I like the font. This is just one of the better posters in my opinion. Coming in at number three, I have Halloween 3, Season of the Witch. This poster is absolutely fire. I love the coloring. I love the silhouettes. And this shot from the movie is just so good. I also really like the font on this one as well. Coming in at number two, I have Halloween 1978. This is a lit poster. Everything about it is amazing. The pumpkin, the knife, the font, the saying that they have on the poster, the night he came home. This one is just absolutely iconic. And as you can see, I have it displayed behind me. So it is definitely one of my favorites. But finally, coming in at number one, I have Halloween 2. There is just something about this poster that does it for me. The face on the pumpkin is so cool. I love the way it's lit up. And again, I like the font. I just think this one looks so cool. I was kind of torn on whether or not to give the first place to the first movie poster or the second movie poster. In a way, they are kind of equal to me. It is really hard to pick, but in the moment as I was ranking these, there was just something about the Halloween 2 poster that really caught my eye. I think this poster is great, but let me know down in the comments, what is your ranking? How do you rank these posters? And which one is your favorite? Please give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. Please turn on all notifications so that you don't miss out on any future posts. A lot more content coming during Spookfest 2024. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.